there should be no such thing as Black History Month, and the same goes for Women's Month. Our queens, empresses, and princesses should be celebrated every waking moment, but I digress. Today's question, as we close out this year's Women's History Month, who's your favorite female video game character? All right, so my favorite character, female character in a video game is Inkling in Mario Kart 8 Deluxe. And the reason why I, I love her is because she seems like a badass, <laughs> point blank. Like, she's not dainty, she's, she seems free-spirited, which resonates with me, right? Um, she has her little gun, especially at the end when she wins, she totes her gun and, you know, she's like, yeah, you know, she's free-spirited. Um, so yeah, I love playing her the way how she is, especially her specials when she, when I, when I would do certain jumps and she would wild out. I love it. So yeah, it's simple. It's not much, but I mean, she's my favorite character. Favorite female video game character? Well. The mo one of the most recent games that I've played is Death Stranding. And in terms of somebody that comes to mind, I would say Fragile. So she is a essentially the CEO, or the, she's, a, she's at the helm, running her father's delivery business in a post-apocalyptic world. Like, legit. Like, ghosts and everything running around wreaking havoc, or BTs as they're called in this game. So that's pretty badass. And on top of that, she's had to like go toe to toe with terrorists in her own company. And then she literally took a nuclear bomb out of a major city, bare na like butt naked, right? And almost died in the process of trying to get it out of the city. Like that is absolutely insane. And I really respect that. Like I love her character and the role that she plays in the game and how she has such a strong willed um, presence in the story overall. My favorite female video game character has to be Lenneth from Valkyrie Profile. Let me give you a, a little story about her, right? So when she was young, she almost got sold into slavery by her parents, but her friend rescued her. She later on lost her memory and then became a Valkyrie, right? She later on became one of the most powerful Valkyries. So much so that she managed to avenge Odin when he lost to the underworld. Another thing that I love about her is her commanding voice. Like, when she talks, I can't help but say yes ma'am. I use her voice for my streams. Like, when someone donates, you hear, you have served me well, my Aunt Harriar. And when someone follows my stream, follows my channel, you hear, to my side, my noble Aunt Harriar. And you just can't help but get up and fight something. Fight what? Don't know. Fighting something. You have served me well, my Ein Harriar. International Women's Month, uh, my favorite female video game character. Well, uh, it would have to be the Valkyries in real life, but we're talking about video games, so there's so many to pick from. You have Arbosa and Zelda from The Legend of Zelda, but I'm going to pick one like per year, because I think I'm going to be doing this each year. For this year, 2022, I'm going to pick Samus Aran from Metroid. Now, why Samus? because Samus is one of the most powerful female characters I know in video game history. And I'm not talking about for a female. Samus will body the Contra guys, Gears of War. Don't talk about Mass Effect. Master Chief will get it too, even he will get it too. Samus is so badass in the greatest Metroid game of all time, Super Metroid. She's fighting Mother Brain in the last part of the game. And Mother Brain conjures up all the power from the planet and hits Samus with a beam. And she gets up and washes Mother Brain, destroy the planet Zebes, and saves the galaxy. That's one bad chick. We've got some strong picks today. Leave yours in the comment section below. Look out for our next video game related question and answer here on the Lab Video Game TV, where our game is never over.